I don't know what I am going to do. I just got a job teaching an EFL listening course at the university. How am I supposed to teach listening? Is that actually teachable? Of course it is. There is a lot of research on how to teach listening. Plus there is a lot of crap on the internet, but forget that. Listen to me, and I can help. But aren't you American? I thought Americans knew everything about speaking, but nothing about listening? Might you be different? Ha ha. Very funny. I get it. I hear what you are saying. Hearing? Well, hearing is not the same as listening, is it? Of course they are different. That's what I am saying. There you go again. Saying, not listening. Listening is an active, purposeful processing of making sense of what we hear. Listening involves constructing meaning and understanding speech. Listening is an active process of selecting and interpreting information. The situation and context can influence listening. And background knowledge is also a factor. A language student's comprehension can depend on what they know about a topic and what auditory clues and visual clues the teacher can provide. Wow, I'm impressed. But, what does that have to do with teaching listening? Well, as a teacher, you need to help students develop schemata. That means background knowledge. There are content schema and textual schema. Content schema include the knowledge a language learner has about the topic, knowledge gained from life's experiences, and specific knowledge about the culture. Textual schema are knowledge of language and content used in a particular situation. To fully comprehend a message, language students need to understand context and register. So you are saying, if you are talking about football, I won't understand because I don't have a bloody clue about what you Americans call football? You got it. But, if I explain what a field goal is, and then show you a short video of a field goal, you may be able to process information in a conversation about field goals. So, to teach listening, I need to provide students with background information, visual clues, and make connections to what they already know from their life experiences? Yes, that is called pre-listening. You need to have pre-listening activities for your students to build schemata. It is like making scaffolding to build a building. Wow, it seems there is a lot more to teaching listening than just pushing a button or talking to a class full of blank stares. There is actually teaching involved, oh bloody hell. I hadn't expected I would actually have to teach. I thought it would be push a button, and the students would just listen. Teaching listening is much more than that. But, I can help you. Start by using these tips.